So this activity that we're running today at this school is part of a wider project we're running towards the Big Bang School Fair, which dedicates time and energy from many large companies to support and encourage school-age students to think about STEM subjects. Cummins has created a student activity based around the ideas of managing time, money and handling a complex engineering based scenario in order to try and open up the possibilities that this could be a useful and interesting career for people that haven't necessarily thought about this before. We have asked all the students to look at a case study of a major natural disaster that's taken place in the last five years. One is a volcanic eruption based in Iceland, one is a tsunami based in Sri Lanka. They have to create renewable energy on site in a very short time frame to support the people and the environment they're in. I don't think they realised at first what kind of planning would be involved, so they're having to put together budgets and they're going back and realising that um, you know, the more tents they have, that means they have to have more power, so it's really engaging them and they're working really hard actually. It's nice to see them working so well together. A scale model of the biomass generator and you've got a wind turbine then a house with solar panels on. This is hydro. Yeah, hydro thing the thing which goes in the waves. And this is a solar dish. Cummins know that it's important to get a younger generation involved with the uh, the STEM subjects and try and get the kids motivated because I think there's a genuine lack of knowledge about um, what an engineer is. I think they think it's just working on cars in a garage, but that's a mechanic, not, a, not an engineer. And we know that there is a, a shortage nationally of uh, students interested in STEM subjects, so it's really nice to see particularly the number of girls we've had volunteer to, to take part in Engineering Day. And we had 134 students email who would like a place, but unfortunately we had to narrow it down to just 40. Uh, so there was quite a lot of competition. Engineering was really fun. I didn't realise how fun it was until today. I used to think it was just something to do with cars and just really making car engines, but now I know it's like train engines, cars, lorries and all uh, like machines for mining. I find it really fun. I want to be an engineer now. My views on engineering have changed a lot today. It has opened my eyes to realise there is a lot of options out there for engineering and STEM subjects. So the two winning teams Okay, you're going to be coming with us to the Big Bang Fair, so one of you will come on one day, Thursday, and the other one on the Friday, and you're going to be sharing your presentation with all of the visitors that come to visit our stands. The team that just edged out in front of the others was the Blue Volcano team. Cummins Engineering, thank you very much for being here today. I've loved every minute of it.